Hey guys, I think maybe this is working finally. So uh, everyone keeps telling me to do this live video thing, and I wanted to share this real quick with you guys. Um, I've had this amazing change in my students lately because of uh, something I call musical dollars. <laughs> so what it is, it's like, uh, you know, this is play money. I got a whole bunch of this play money, and um, for each song that the child knows how to play uh, by heart, uh, and they can play it reasonably well, uh, I give them a dollar. And after they have the dollar, they, they start adding them up into their, their uh, wallet. <laughs> the wallet is actually their, their notebook. And uh, I'm going to show you here. We got some. This is what I call the teacher story. You can see it's kind of sold out right now. Uh, a lot of kids uh, went crazy. So I had each little cup filled with little trinkets and toys and candies. Some of them higher price. You see $10 would get you one of these flashy uh, glow rings, which are super cool. And bouncy balls and even a 20-sided die in there. For a dollar, you can get this sticker of a fat sumo. <laughs> no one seemed to take that one up. Oh, most of my Halloween rings are all gone now, right? These uh, these were pretty popular too. The Halloween pretzels were five dollars, but apparently not a big hit. Uh, I ran out of all my snap bands, and I had lots of colored pencils, which were mostly sold out already. So the uh, the idea of this is to reward good practice. And I didn't think this would be any big deal. I was very skeptical. Uh, I've talked to a bunch of music teachers who I work with, and they were like, ah, oh, yeah, you know, kids like candy. I just didn't realize how much they like candy and just earning stuff. So now it's like all about the dollars. They're, uh, they're always like counting up these dollars and it's like, can I get a dollar? And, you know, I, I, I always try to make sure that they are learning a new song but i'll say okay if you uh, if you want to earn a new uh, a new dollar you can play me one of your old songs and what's happened is that in the past i've had kids who only would know the last one or two songs in their repertoire now i have kids playing 10 to 15 songs from memory uh actually even really long songs so i'm like pretty thrilled at the success of this so if you have uh uh, kids at home who are learning to play music and you're not doing something like this, I highly recommend checking out this. Uh, I know a lot of schools do it as well. Scholar dollars, they call it. So you can just, you know, get little rewards, little toys, trinkets, um, and just start counting them up. I know that um, you can even look on Amazon. There's like party favors or Google something for uh, toys for dentist offices or school reward kits, or just go to the dollar store if you have one near you. Uh, I have to do another <laughs> purchase order, I can see, because I've already run out of what I thought was gonna last me uh, a few months. These kids have gone crazy. All right, so I hope that was a helpful little tip about motivating kids to practice music or actually even anything else, doing their homework. Uh, you, uh, I have other kids who have actually been uh, rewarded with screen time. That's another topic for another day. All right, take care.